Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today. I was contacted by the founder of Chocola and was asked to do a review on these wet wipe markers. They're best used on all hard, non-porous surfaces such as glass, whiteboards, mirrors, plastic, chalkboards, and ceramics. The tip of the marker is a bullet tip and it's a 5.5 millimeter tip. I love the vibrant colors and I have tested it out on several surfaces in my home and I am going to share the performance with you here on my video. So I'm going to tilt my camera down. I took one of my everyday wear and tried the black and the blue marker on this dish and I'm going to remove it with a wet wipe to see if there's any residue left on the dish. So first I'll try the blue. Look at the bright color. I love the colors and that easily was easily removed. Do it once again here. And I'll try the black. Black is always difficult to remove for some reason. So I'll do the black. And then I'll wipe it with a dry cloth. Under this side. Remove the black. And with a dry cloth, I wipe that down. So the performance is great on the dish. I do not see any ghosting images or ghost images on the dish. It's completely clean. Now, on occasion, I do go to crops, and there are uh, some items that I like to carry with me and share. So I wanted to try this dye and see how the markers uh, were removed from this surface. So here's my wipe and I've used the purple and the white on this surface. So here we go, removing that. And I'll do the white. Wipe it down. And once again, that has completely vanished from the dye. Now, I also did a glass piece, and I use this throughout the year, and I do like to add a either Christmas item underneath or a um, fall just different items I like to put under this dome. So I went around the top and colored it with the red marker. And I'm gonna see how it re is uh, removed from the top of this one in the red. I'm trying to try the different colors and see if anything is left behind. And there we go, that's the red. I'm going to just wipe it with a dry cloth. And as you can see, it is completely gone. I do want to take you to another part of my house. It's actually outside, and I've used it on a chalkboard that I have outside. So I'll meet you there in just a minute. I have a welcome sign. It's a chalkboard sign that I have outside on my patio. And yesterday I wrote the word welcome, and I also stenciled some of the fall leaves that are on the chalkboard. I left it overnight. It is an enclosed area, uh, but the image still stayed nice and colorful and it didn't rub off. So this little chalkboard here I use for different seasons and at Christmas time I'll change it out with little Christmas decorations and then write a Christmas message. 
uh, Christmas message. So I like how it performed on the chalkboard as well. So I'll meet you back inside to give you my final review. So for my overall review of the Chocola markers, I did like them. I like the vibrant colors. I like the fact that they don't rub off the surfaces that were indicated on the package. Uh, the chalkboard I used, the uh, ceramic plate, and also the glass. I did try it on my mirror and it performed just as well as it did on the glass. So I give it a thumbs up on the Chocola markers. And thanks everyone for watching. Take care.